In this video, I'm going to show you how to identify a multivariate outlier in a multiple regression model. We're going to go ahead and use the Mahalanobis critical distance calculator method. It's one I like best. Okay, let's run a regression model. We go to... Oh, let me show you what it is first. So we're going to use hours of exercise, calories, minutes sitting to try to predict weight loss. So weight loss is the DV, okay? Let's do this. Let's go to analyze regression linear. The DV is we're trying to predict weight loss based on how much they exercise, how many calories, and how many minutes they sit all day. Uh, so just going by natural instinct here, I'm just going to do this because these, these address most of the assumptions, which we're not going to check. We're only going to check one assumption. Plus, I'm going to skip that one. But this is your, this is your multivariate outlier test box, right? The critical distance. Um, we're going to use the Mahalanobis, but there is a Cook's critical distance and a leverage. You can go ahead and use those if you want. Uh, but again, I prefer the Mahalanobis. We're going to click continue. And we're going to go ahead and run the analysis. And I'll pull up the output here. And we're going to get a little box that says Mahalanobis maximum distance. Here it is right here. So let me adjust this a little bit so you can see it. And there it is. Okay, these are your, uh, your residual statistics. So there's your Mahalanobis. And what this means is you go to your maximum, that's this column. So it means from your data set, you have a maximum of 23.475. Again, somebody in that data set has a Mahalanobis critical distance of, of 23.475. That's the Mahalanobis distance. Now we're going to calculate the critical distance by using the calculator. So pay no attention to these numbers up here. This is from a previous problem. But, so alpha, that's our 0 0.05. We're going to leave it there unless somebody tells us something different. Our sample size is 154. And our K is the number of predictor variables. And ours is 3. Okay, so look at there. That is the calculated Mahalanobis distance. The critical value. So in other words... 18.58 is a maximum. So anybody in your data set that has a Mahalanobis distance value greater than 18.58 is considered a multivariate outlier. So let me go back to this state table and show you how that works again. Where are you? Boom. Right. Mahalanobis from your data set. You got somebody with 23.475 Mahalanobis distance, which means... It's greater than this number. So that means you do have at least one outlier. And now we're going to go find out what it is. We simply go back to our data set with the numbers on it. And it should have created a new variable called Mahalanobis, which it did. We're going to open that sucker up. We're going to go right click and just sort descending. And so this top guy, you have one multivariate outlier that you should probably get rid of because regressions are very, very, very sensitive to outliers. So let's take a look at this guy. He's high on exercise. He's high on calories. He's high on minutes sitting. So, right. So he's, he's very, very high. He's an outlier in three of the predictor variables. So that's how you would identify a multivariate outlier using the Mahala Novus critical distance calculator. That's it. Hope that helps. MGZ out.